More than one and a quarter million power customers across seven northeast states have been left struggling in the dark by a huge ice storm. The deep freeze has blocked roads and closed schools from Maine to Pennsylvania. Massachusetts governor has declared a state of emergency as folks in the state clean up damage from snapped lines. Um, and the power and the electricity, everything, the heat went off last night at 10 o'clock. And this tree, as you can see, came down on my husband's car. And we're just trying to deal with the aftermath. That whole tree gave, gave way by its roots. This is the worst I've ever seen, and I've been in New England my entire life. An emergency also has been declared in neighboring New Hampshire. With more than half the state's power customers without power, some residents have headed to shelters to stay warm. It's not the Ritz, but it's, it's sure better than having no heat and no light. The frigid situation may not change for hundreds of thousands of New Englanders until next week. Officials say the slick conditions make it unlikely that power will be restored for several days. While the storm has passed, single-digit temperatures are forecast for parts of the region tomorrow night. And at least one death is blamed on the weather. New Hampshire officials say a 49-year-old man died of carbon monoxide poisoning. He had turned on his generator to heat his camper home after losing power. Sophia Manos, The Associated Press.